and the humphead parrotfish. Come in, Dashy. Is the octopod in position? We're at the surface, Captain. The show will be starting any minute. We'll be right there, just as soon as we get Peso's patient back home. Allow me. Your patient is heavier than a pile of cannonballs. Just a little polar bear strength. Thanks, Captain. Whoa, that guy's pretty strong. You know it. Hi, there's no one in the seven seas stronger than Captain Barnacles. Why, I've seen him pry open the lid of a rusty treasure chest, lift up giant rocks, twist the lid off a jar of jam that nobody else could open. What was that? Hello, Hattie here. Oh, this looks interesting. Flappity flippers. She took a bite right out of that rock. Now that is strong. You know it. Oh, yes, I just love to bite rocks or, or coral or anything, really. I'm a humphead parrotfish and I have special teeth that... Oh, that looks interesting. <gasps> Those are some teeth. You know it. Look, is that sand? Yes, yes. Rocks go in, sand comes out. Oh, now this looks interesting. Careful, Hattie. You just took a bite out of our gop. Oopsie. Awfully sorry. When I get a chance to chomp, I just can't resist it. It's how we humphead parrotfish eat. Captain, you better get up here fast. It's about to begin. OK, Dashy, we're on our way. Bye, Hattie. What do you think they were rushing off for? I don't know, but there might be something new to chop. Wait for me! Captain, you're just in time. The meteor shower is just starting. There's one. Look. Oh, this is wonderful. <gasps> oh, wow. Ruskamuta. That's a meteor tunic. A meteor is a piece of rock flying through space. When lots of them are in the sky at once, like tonight, it's called a meteor shower. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Ooh. Whoa, that one looks like it might be heading this way. Hmm. Occasionally, a meteor will fall to the Earth. Some, well, most in fact, land right in the ocean. Hmm. Then we'd better move the octopod just to be on the safe side. Dashy. Already on it, Captain. Open the octo hatch, Tweak. We're coming in. You got it, Cap. Ooh, this looks interesting. <laughs> Whoa! Come in, Dashy. What's going on in there? Oh, we're falling fast, Captain. Something's wrong with the octopod's engines. They've completely shut down. Then we'll have to prepare for a crash landing. Octonauts, hold on. Extend and lock the pod arms. It just might wedge us in. Go for it. Ah! 
Is everyone all right? Yes, Captain. Safe and sound. Captain, you're not going to believe this. What is it, Dashie? It's the meteor tracker, Captain. The meteor Quasi saw is about to crash into the ocean, and it's heading straight for us. Dashie, sound the Octo Alert. Octonauts to the HQ. Octonauts, there's a meteor heading our way, and the octopod is stuck. I'll get to work on the engine, Cap. Dashie, how much time do we have? Not long, Captain. In just a few minutes, the meteor will hit the ocean, and then the octopod. <laughs> then we'll have to find some way to move the octopod. I think I found the problem, Cap. Looks like something took a chunk right out of the engine. But don't worry, I'll have it fixed up faster than you can say bunch of munchy crunch. Huh? Tweet, what was that noise? I don't know. But now there's another missing chunk. Hmm. Actually, Cap, this could take me a while. If we can't fix the engine and move the octopod in time, then we need to find a way to stop the meteor. Shellington, Inkling, what else do we know about meteors? Well, as you can see, they look like big black rocks. Yes, but they're actually part metal. Metal? That's right. In fact, they can even be magnetic. Hmm, magnetic. <gasps> that gives me an idea. Quasi, peso, to the guts. <laughs> Octonauts, these magnets should stick to the meteor and slow it down, but it's moving fast. We have to shoot our magnets and hit the meteor at the exact same time. Quasi, Peso, take your positions. It's coming in fast, mateys. Get ready. Steady. Steady! Dashy, I'm attached to the meteor, but I can't stop it! Prepare to evacuate the octopod! Attention, Octonauts! Report to the launch bay! We need to leave the octopod immediately. Huh? Where's all this sand coming from? So you're what's been taking chunks out of our engine. Oops! <laughs> I'm sorry. There are just so many interesting things to munch around here. Well, you'd better clear out. A big rock from outer space is about to hit the octopod. A rock from outer space? Sounds delicious. Hold on. If you can chomp through this engine, I reckon you can chomp through that meteor. Chomping rocks is my speciality. And I've never tasted one from outer space before. Um, do you have any friends around here? <laughs> Second time lucky, Captain. Ready, Peso? I can do this. I can do this. Well done, you two. But it's still not enough. Don't worry, Cap. Help is on the way. Patty. All right, boys. Who's hungry? <laughs> It's working, but we've got to give the parrotfish more time. Pull back on your reverse thrusters. Give it everything you've got. <laughs> Look! Here they come! They're moving fast. Captain, time until impact is five. I'm losing contact with the meteor. <laughs> Delicious! 
this. The engines are working again, Cap. Thanks, Tweak. Good work today, Octonauts. And thanks for your help, Hattie. Oh, it was no trouble at all. After all that meteor chomping, I'd better check on your teeth. Open your mouth and say, ah, uh, oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs>